So you might be in a situation where you want to go ahead and enable data roaming on your iPhone. Now, doing this is actually very basic and it really doesn't take too much time at all. So the very first thing you're going to want to do is you want to hop inside of your settings application of your iPhone. So hop inside of settings and you'll come into this particular page. Now what you want to do here is you want to tap on your cellular option, which is right here. So right under Wi-Fi and Bluetooth, you'll see cellular. You want to tap on cellular and you'll come into this next specific panel. Now what you're going to want to do here, it's very, very basic. You're going to see this cellular data options panel that comes up right here. What you're going to want to do is you want to tap on that option and then this next page is going to come up. So what you're going to want to do here for number one, you want to toggle data roaming on right up here. So what that's going to do is if you're going out of, you know, your specific cell services area, and if you want to still have cell service or data or whatever, by enabling data roaming, you're basically going to still get those specific signal and get that data coming in from your specific account. So that is one option you have there. So that's typically the most common thing and that will pretty much work itself out. Now, if you do that and that's not working or you don't want to do whatever the case is, the other thing you can do is you can always just go call your carrier and ask them if you even have data roaming as an option. You should and you should be able to toggle it on from there. Now under voice and data, you can keep this on whichever one you want. Typically I keep this on LTE, but you can change it to whichever one you want. And under data mode, you can also kind of change this to whichever way you want to as well. But data roaming is the one you want to go ahead and enable. And for some reason you're not you know, able to roam with data, that might not be part of your cell plan or maybe it's not available for your carrier or you're just in an area that has zero signal at all. So that's the other thing you're going to have to look into as well. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. The like button helped me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.